Hey there to YouTube. I'm Al. I'm from Bon Voyage Expeditions. Well, first of all, I would like to... Two things I would like to do. We would like to apologize we didn't make a lot of videos uh, since we got back from Texas due to the fact we got, everybody got sick. <clears throat> Still getting, getting to know what it's called. Slash flu. There's a bad flu going around Florida. So we got better now. Now we got to be uh, hopefully trying to travel again and uh, you know get things done. Second of all, uh, we a lot of people ask us and a lot of people send us requests for maintenance <laughs> vlogs. Uh, and today I just came up with an idea. Okay, it's been we traveled thirty thousand miles this year, so far. I mean, including last year. Uh, last year, I mean, I'm sorry, thirty thousand miles last year. And uh, well, what we gotta do right now is uh, we gotta. Clean now injectors. Uh, this truck has 164,000 miles on it right now. Uh, and um, let me see what we have. Uh, uh, there you go. And it's working. Hmm. And no check engine lights. <laughs> As everybody claims that um, the Ranger was bad and so on and so forth. It, it's not bad, uh, but what we gotta do is we gotta clean our injectors. Now, to clean our injectors, what we need to have is what we, that's what I do. Okay, I did this about six times so far. Um, uh, what we do is uh, we have uh, we keep the vehicle at forty uh, at quarter of a tank. Okay, we gotta put fluid in in our tank, and then we gotta drive it to thirty to forty uh, thirty to forty miles on a highway. Okay, and I you just uh, give it a go. Uh, so uh, my neighbor just came by. So um, uh, we will uh, definitely show you guys how it's done, and uh, and show you what kind of fluid. So here I am back. Um, uh, the equipment for a uh, clean cleaning this uh, fuel system and injectors. This is what we use the 44k fuel system cleaner, BNG. Part number two zero eight. Okay, um, I have used this with great success. The uh, Land Rover approved, and uh, it's, it's an awesome product. It's for professional use only. Not that I'm a professional or anything, <laughs> but uh, I think uh, um, it's a great. Uh, it's a it's an awesome product. Also, also funnel. Uh, use this kind of funnel. Um, Land Rovers are notorious to have a deep well. Um, gas tank, so it's, we set it right uh, over um, deep inside of the vehicle. So uh, you gotta need this kind, not the short one, the, the long one. And what you do is you just you put that in the gas tank, and then you pour this inside. Okay, so here we are, ladies and gentlemen. Forty-four K, the funnel. You press. To open, yes, thing. You take the cap out. Okay, we insert this into the yes tank. We pop this open. Oh. As usual, it's always a pain. Uh, it looks like <laughs> a very old whiskey. I don't know if you guys can see it. Put it on the sun here. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. It looks like a, a cognac type of uh, exo, maybe. Uh, uh, or I would say even v, uh, the VSOP type of thing. Um, uh, anyway, so you just pour inside. Now, don't spill this. <laughs> you need because it can it can get 
pretty uh, bad out there. So you're on the road right now. We gotta t go and uh, drive it right now. Okay, gotta get on the highway. I-95 in Hollywood, Florida. See you in a few. And uh, we have uh, obviously currently we have. Let me see. I'm sure you guys can see that. It's 163, whatever it is, miles on here. Okay. And obviously, it's like quarter of a tank. And 163 miles. 63,000 miles. Okay. So now, we gotta take a ride. We gotta kill the miles. I mean, uh, we gotta the mile counter here. We press here to make it to zero in, zero miles. And then we drive. We drive for uh, a good 30 miles. Yes, yes. So we can all chat and drive at the same time. I just did 23 miles uh, one way, uh, and uh, I'm going in, uh, going back. Now uh, I would like to have a little rant with Florida and uh, tax them. I think Florida is one of the worst states to drive in, and very unsafe due to the fact that people tax them here. Florida does not have uh, uh, tax law is on books. Uh, texting while driving is on books. The problem is it's uh, class two, I believe, and I wish it would be uh, class one because it's, it's extremely dangerous to drive here. People are so irresponsible to text and drive at the same time, and it's, it's just ridiculous. You know, people, please. You know, I mean, honestly, it can wait. You know, uh, if any legislature, uh, legislate, led legislative guys or whoever in in, uh, in the government listening to this. Please pass pass the law. You know, pass the law so that, that way will be a punishment for people, and it's a very hefty fine, preferably like five hundred dollar fine. So that way people would you know uh, would stop taxing, and they they're gonna get to these thick heads that is extremely extremely dangerous. Uh, this is not a joke. It, it, it's it's really ridiculous. You know, people swerving all the time. People uh, you know uh, breaking, going slow. They don't. They, they, it's it's ridiculous. Anyways. Um, now let's go back to uh, completing the injectors. Uh, now we, since I did 23, now it's 25 miles, but I'm going back already. Uh, go, uh, uh, I did the drive. Now we gotta go back to uh, a gas station and fill up, you know, I'm gonna do a, a full fill up with a super gas. Obviously LRs, I mean, all Range Rovers and all, uh, I guess, luxury vehicles do require uh, super. I would say German vehicles, European vehicles, they require super anyways. Don't put, listen, if you're driving a, you know, a luxury vehicle, don't put regular gas in it. Do yourself, do yourself a big favor, okay, because the money that you're saving, eventually is going to come and bite you, and it will bite you. Uh, with your injectors, with your uh, uh, sensors, you know, uh, it, it's just got to be a big pain, and it's got to it's gotta come and uh, come knocking. So, um, again, I'm, I'm an original owner of this truck with so many miles and we drive a lot, okay? Uh, this is the only way I clean my injectors. I have never t taken them out. I have never used any other systems except what I just showed. So, um, hopefully it's going to help somebody. Also, um, I would like to thank the YouTubers and our followers. We, we hit a thousand viewers uh, and uh, you know we would like to thank you guys for subscribing and we would like to thank you guys for supporting us uh, and basically that's it so um, we'll see you in a gas station but there's a one one big but uh, the gas station that we go to it's not a gas station it's a religion and again going back to this again 
we're going to Wawa. Wawa is not just a gas station. It's a religion. Okay? It's incredible. It's an incredible place. I, I, I just, I can't, I can't stress it enough. I'm literally in love with this place. Uh, we're not sponsored by them by any way, shape, or form. Uh, but um, uh, we, they, they don't give us any money, monetary, nor uh, any donations or anything else. We just, uh, we love the place. We, I think this place is incredible. They're expanding. They're expanding to, to Florida now, and they, they grow and exponentially. It's, it's awesome. And I'm very happy to see this company grow the way, the way it's growing. Um, and nothing changes. Wawa is just incredible, you know, exactly the same thing that what it is in Florida. It's the same thing. It, 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 it's the same thing in New Jersey, same thing in PA, same thing in Delaware. It, it's it's an amazing, just an amazing store. Okay, so uh, I definitely urge you guys to check it out and support it. Okay, so stay tuned. Uh, right now it's obviously Florida and I'm on 995, so right now I'm hitting traffic. And traffic, there it goes. <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh. And now we get up. Good super. Full tank. And there we go. We are Wawa. <laughs> so, um, see you guys uh, on the road. That's how it's done. The injector cleaning <laughs> from Bon Voyage Expeditions. Take it easy. So I'm coming back to base uh, from our injector cleaning uh, little escapade. <laughs> now, what happens is that uh, uh, I would like to show you guys what an average fuel uh, fuel um, uh, usage is on a vehicle of this sort. Basically, LR is a big brick on wheels. Uh, especially, we have all kinds of gear on the top as well. And it's it's pretty heavy, uh, I would say. Obviously, larger tires, you know, a lot of a lot of a lot of footprint. So, if you guys uh, here is, if you guys willing to see, here's the our average fuel usage. As of right now. So it's not that bad for a vehicle of this size and this vehicle of this weight to perform perform this way. And basically, it, 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 people say you know they're inefficient, they break a lot, and so on and so forth. I don't think it's true, but to each their own. So uh, basically, that's it for our fuel injector escapade. Uh, enjoy. Comment below. Thank you again for your subscri subscriptions. Subscribe, and uh, we'll, we'll have uh, more videos coming soon. Okay, as we are going to other expeditions slash overland trips. Okay, so stay tuned for those, and uh, bon voyage.